Hi guys, in this video I'll talk about behavior trees. Behavior tree is a methodology for design behavior, just like state machine. Some behaviors can be easily designed by behavior trees and others with state machines. Usually behaviors that have some type of priority or order are more easily developed with behavior trees. For example, Imagine an enemy that needs to reload its weapon when the aim is low, or that he needs to protect its base, or that he runs away from the battle when his health is low. In this video, I will develop a very simple behavior tree. It will move the cube to the green square again. But when it gets there, it will wait an interval time and then move back to the blue square. The blue square it to wait another interval time and then repeat this movement. I use again the move to node. At this time the behavior tree does the same thing as the action state from the first video. It moves the cube from its position to the green square. The main difference between the tree and the action state is that the behavior trees have some more nodes, the branch nodes. They are the composite, decorator and function nodes. With these nodes, you can create a parent-child relationship. For instance, the update function node is the parent of the move to. The function nodes are always the root nodes and they start the execution of the tree. The composite nodes are used to decide which nodes should be run and the decorator nodes add spatial behavior to its child. For instance, the sequence is a composite node that has an end logic. It will keep running its child while they return success. It keeps running the first child until it succeeds, and then it runs the second child, and so on. All nodes have an execution status, and you can visually see it in runtime by its highlighted color. For example, the move 2 has the blue highlighted color, and for a frame, it is green. The blue color means that the node needs more than one frame to finish its execution. The blue color is the running status. And the green color means that the node has succeeded and they finish its execution. The green color is the success status. That's also the failure status, yellow color, and error status, the red color. Thus, status are used by the composite nodes to decide if they should stop or keep running its children. I use the wait node to wait 2 seconds. So, when the move to succeeded, then the wait node will start its execution and wait 2 seconds. I will also duplicate the move to and the wait node. But the destination of this move to will be the blue square. Let's hit play. The move to finish its execution and then wait 2 seconds. The second move to start its execution and then wait 2 seconds. There is no explicit transition between nodes. They don't know each other and all the execution is decided by the running status of the nodes. This is the major difference between trees and stage machines. Thank you for watching.